Uh, libraries are going to have some special activities going on as we get into the new year. And one in particular involves a visit from a very accomplished author. And here to tell us about that is Teen Services Coordinator Leah Wayant from the library. We appreciate you being with us this morning. Thank you for having the library on. All right. We're going to be, uh, or at least we're going to be honoring uh, another great author mm -hmm. in May. Yes. Tell us about the recipient. Who's, who's going to so, be So, Lori Hall Sanderson is the 2017 um, Ann V. Zero Award winner for Young People's uh, Literature. And she's a fabulous author who writes mostly for young adults, right. middle schoolers, high schoolers, and National Book Award finalists has just a very decorated author, so we're so excited to be hosting her. We have uh, brought in, or you brought in some of the books right behind. Mm -hmm. uh, Forge, Ashes, Chains are just uh, three of the books that she's written. It's mainly for yes. middle school students, right? It is mainly for middle school students. So this series follows um, two uh, young children in the American Revolutionary period. So they're fighting for their freedom, um, they're uh, fighting for America's freedom, and trying to decide what they're going to do and how they're going to integrate into the new country. Very so um, it's kind of timely with the whole Hamilton zeitgeist. Sure, sure. Uh, there's going to be a creative writing contest, and actually uh, the author right here, Lori, is going to be presenting those awards to him. But the creative cons the creative writing contest is in February? Yes, so the um, Young People's Creative Writing Contest that we hold annually is going to be um, from February 1st through March 4th is when right. entries are accepted. There are five categories for young people to enter, and ages 10 to 18 can enter every category in their age division. Um, age divisions are 10 to 12, 13 to 15, and 16 to 18. And categories are poems, short stories, informal nonfiction essay, a short play, and even a graphic uh, comic story. And this is for ages uh, 10 to 18, and big incentive for cash prizes involved. Cash prizes is dollars for first place, and if you win first place in more than one uh, category, well, there you make go. Make. Let's save up for college or uh, <laughs> ice cream or something like that. I don't know. Yeah, or a new iPhone. <laughs> yeah, or a new iPhone. Sure, sure. All right. One other big, uh, big weekend is going to be the 28th for teachers. It's going to mm -hmm. be a big workshop. Tell us about yes, that. Yes, so Mr. Henry's Books Teacher Workshop is an uh, annual workshop that Mr. Henry Zero championed and helped fund in the Zero Family Foundation um, funds uh, still today. So teachers can, for t a $10 registration fee, um, join the workshop and get a classroom set of the um, books for uh, Chains, the National Book Award finalist um, entry to the trilogy. And those books are really designated to be given to the kids so that the kids get their own copy and then sure. they can take it and meet um, the author when she comes in um, May. And actually, one educator that um, comes to the workshop will get a classroom visit from Ms. Anderson oh, wow. herself. Okay. Outstanding. Outstanding. Again, the award presentation is going to be in May, mm -hmm. and that's when they're going to also award the creative writing type contest. Yes, absolutely. So a lot going on, and, and teachers, there's still time for teachers to There's still time for teachers to register. Workshop. Yep, they should just go um, register through Tulsa Kids, and they'll take care of their registration fee, and they can learn more information about it on our website. Lots of great things happening at the library. Thank you so much, Leah. Thank you for having me. All right, Tulsa County Library Events, Mr. Henry's Books Teacher Workshop, Jan January 28th, Young People's Creative Writing Contest. Now they're still accepting entries February the 1st through March the 4th. And is there a war presentation again May the 5th for a complete list of events? Check out the website, Tulsa Library.